today I'm going to be doing something a little different. I've always wanted to do this and show you guys a controller cam on how I play Gears of War. This is like my version of a modified claw. I use my ring finger to hit the right trigger, my middle finger to hit the right bumper, and my index finger to hit the face buttons. Everything else is the same. So we're just going to jump right into this. If you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Statistically, you are likely to fail, but do try to enjoy yourself. A new weapon is obtainable. Yeah, I got back on Gears after, you know, a long time. I've been really itching to play this game. This is a game that I just, I love to play. It's fun with friends, it's fun by yourself. At least to me, in any setting, you can really have a good time with this. Um, yeah, I found this mode that I guess they added it on here. I don't remember seeing it before. It's a 14-player free-for-all. And it's actually really fun. The bots are on advanced difficulty. So um, they put up a little bit more of a fight, and it's, it's a really fun, fun uh, thing to do. I am a little rusty, you know, I haven't really played this uh, consistently how I used to play many years ago, but, you know, the skills are there a little bit still, does feel good to play Gears, you know, some of my favorite all-time shooters are definitely Gears of War, uh, Halo, probably my number one top favorite shooter of all time, you know, from the early 2000s with Halo 1. You know, Halo 1, Halo 2, Halo 3, I didn't like 4, I didn't like 5, haven't really played Infinite yet, Reach is, Reach is goaded, you know, so, you know, uh, about 4 Halo games that I really enjoyed, you know, actually, it was Gears of War, when Gears of War first came out, I actually stopped playing Halo to play Gears of War, because I loved this game so much, you know, when this game came out, it was just next level you know the campaign the multiplayer co-op it was a great feeling good. You know, new thing you know so Halo and Gears of War definitely hold a special place in my heart when it comes to shooters um, you know there's, there's other games you know but uh, for me these are like two big shooters that I have experience with so and then I'd say after that, you know, uh, Battlefield, really enjoyed Battlefield. Um, and of course you have like other shooters like Fortnite, and stuff like that. But as far as what I played, you know, coming up, here's the game. Splinter Cell, but that's like a third person game. You know, there's a bunch of stuff that we're gonna talk about and experience on this channel together. But yeah. Gears is like definitely in my top five.
I thought this was a really cool effect. I guess when you get in the lead, you start to glow. It's uh, kind of like aura around your body. Looks pretty sick. Cool addition, in my opinion. And it kind of puts you in this mode of like, like just having to go hard because you're in the lead and you want to stay in the lead. And there's so many other players that it's like, you just want to keep your lead so that you can end up winning. I think at this point I had started to really warm up and as you can see my reaction time, my awareness and everything is just a lot better at this point. Ten kills. I think I'm going to drop another one of these because I had a lot of fun doing this and I got some more footage and some funny things that happened so I'm probably going to drop another one of these. Remember, if you like this video, be sure you leave me a thumbs up. Also, if you're here watching this and you're not subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button 